Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Robert Cantor. One Piece has been around for two and a half decades, going on three. And I say, wrap it up! One Piece holds several world records, including most copies published for a comic book by a single author. Take a moment and consider everything that has happened in the world since One Piece was first published in 1997. I was in grade school when One Piece was first published in Japan. Now, all these years later, I'm a grown man. America is now an insult away from civil war. And some people seem far too eager to start World War III. I'm starting to think Oda's got an angel looking after him or something. But we already lost Toriyama this year. God rest his soul. And we need to trust the resolution of the Black Frieza thing to someone else. As I said in a previous video, I've already had time to work out how the final chapters of One Piece will more or less play out. Shanks dies, kill Blackbeard, Luffy becomes the Pirate King, all-out war with the world government, not necessarily in that order, and Luffy takes his revenge on Sakazuki at some point along the way. I've also stated in a previous video that the only reason I keep watching One Piece is because Luffy has a sizable harem at this point, and I'm curious to see where it goes. There's at least half a dozen women in this harem, but the actual number depends on who you ask. For example, Robin has been shipped with numerous people since joining the Straw Hats. Luffy, Zoro, Sanji, Frankie, and Law. Unfortunately, Oda seems less interested in romance drama than he is in developing backstories for minor antagonists and such. As I said before, once the war is over and the world government ceases to exist, it stands to reason that all the bounties they placed would become null and void. In the chaos that would inevitably come with building a new world order, I could easily see certain parties trying to forge an alliance with the Straw Hats through marriage, if for no other reason than protecting their interests against opposing or otherwise hostile parties, because no one screws with the Pirate King. To date, Boa Hancock is the only woman to openly declare romantic interest in Luffy, and she got jealous when she learned there were women in Luffy's crew. I really want to see the hilarity that would ensue upon her meeting the rest of the harem. Picture this. There's a big celebration, and... Rebecca works up the courage to ask Luffy to dance with her. God help the woman who asks him for a child. Of course, Luffy will just stand there, denser than a neutron star, completely confused, and say, I don't have any children. <laughs> That's all I've got to say. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and if you really want to help this channel out, then click the links in the description below and buy my books.